<laughs> I like how she actually comments everything. Okay, nah. Nothing to do here. Huh. Those three are not gonna do anything. Damn it! Nonsense. Uh, think. Where do I get the damn ticket? I wonder if I can still get coins and what the purpose would be. It's the wait until you have the first turn game. Ah. Like literally. There we go. Took long enough. <coughs> ah. Whoop. Yay. Another coin. Ugh, whatever. Foo, who is gonna give me their... Hmm, he's gone. Curious. Hmm, nonsense. Ah, damn it. Ugh. I really don't know what to do now. Uh, what do I do? Nyan. Oh, that just throws me in, I remember. Dang it! I'm running a little bit out of ideas. I'm running out of ideas quite a lot. Psh. 
I doubt I can just give that guy like <clears throat> what's it called? Money. Negative. Yeah. No idea. What a, what did I not click yet? Maybe if I talk... Oh no, I can't, damn it. Maybe that skeleton is a magician? What? Huh. I don't know. Fudge! I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing. Like, whatsoever. I don't even know if uh, the crayon still has any use. <sighs> There's just this. There's nothing anywhere. Because I actually do have another look here just because who knows. Okay. Nope, there's nothing here. Huh. Jeez, cat, you are slow. I'm stuck. <laughs> For some reason, that's kind of funny. Ah, uh, where do I get the frickin... Mm. Where's that guy going, anyways? Nowhere, it seems. Damn it! What to do? Oh, 
Okay, the stuff isn't here anymore, but I can still click it. Interesting. So yeah, um, I'm actually allowing hints now, if you have some, because I don't fucking know, and I'm not, and I don't really want to Google that myself. It must be something quite obvious that I'm missing, I guess. Maybe a certain person I have to talk to. Threaten somebody with a knife. Probably not. You mean the, the locust that is running around here? Or the big one? Wherever the other one is running around now. Nowhere, apparently. There it is. I don't think it does anything if I follow it. Nope, it's gone now. And there it comes again. Hmm, well, fudge me sideways. I'm really lost. I really didn't want to look anything up here. That makes me upset. What about... <laughs> I'm slightly upset about myself now that I didn't notice the giant pile of wood suddenly being gone. Come on, kitty, go inside. And remember, I need a ticket to get in, too. So maybe you can take somebody else's. But I don't want to steal. We'll just borrow it, kitty. We can give it back later. Alright? Hmm, alright. Jeez, where the heck am I even? There. <laughs> A drunken bee, alright. She fell asleep? Maybe she drank too much. I often fall asleep when I eat. Anyway, now I can take the ticket and give it to Fran. Yoinks! And out of here. I have the ticket. I have it. You're incredible, kitty. I love you so much. Now we can go inside. <laughs> I'm still upset about that. <laughs> Look, sir. It seems that a ticket found a way to... What? That a ticket found a way to get into my hands. What? Let me see. Hm. This can't be right. Just can't. I already let someone in with that ticket. Oh crap, he noticed. You bring many mysteries, little lady. Huh. But how can you know it ha was somebody else's ticket? The symbols are correct. But look at the handwriting. This belongs to someone much older than you. I can see it. Alright then. Is there any chance to get inside? I mean, is it possible? When you have your own ticket, little lady, you are more than welcome. Oh, bloody hell.
praying. Okay, damn it. Foo! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> and I just thought I had it. Kid. Nope. <laughs> so we are back at the beginning, basically. Beautiful. Wait, what if I... Nope, the person is still inside, damn it. I thought there would, it would be like a time paradox now. <sighs> Can't I get out of this? No, uh Damn it! Like really bloody damn it. Oh, can I now? Ah, brilliant. Okay, that maybe took me a bit longer than I thought. Of course, I couldn't do it before because I didn't know that was a possibility. Look, so I think this is my own ticket. Hmm. Oh, I see. But you simply drew it yourself. Oh, for fuck's sake, just let me in. Yes, I thought it was the right thing to do. I wasn't invited, so I invited myself. Very clever little lady. Well, I guess I can let you in. Finally! Thank you for nothing. Oh, the farting thing. Hello. Oh, hello, you came. How nice. Are you enjoying the show? Yes, very much. But I need the shoes of the dancer. <laughs> yeah, just tell that everyone. I don't know how to get them. <laughs> so you like to dance? He's a very good dancer. I've never seen him fall. Hmm. So he's like the very best dancer of the world? The world? I would say the universe. He always follows the rhythm. I see. Well, thank you. What about we... What if we do something about that? Oh, I see. That's how they make... Sure, you can. <laughs> now it makes sense. Because the thing isn't there at all in winter, you can't get in there by changing anything. Okay. The Locus mask. This one looks very old. Hmm. Ugh. I never saw such a huge moth. I won't bother it. Oh. A lady drinking lemonade all by herself. Maybe she's expecting somebody. Or maybe not. Huh. 
Hello, miss. Are you having a great time? Have you seen my ticket? Mm, I think I... Uh, I have to go. Can't I give it back? Here's your ticket, miss. I'm sorry, but I took it. And I wanted to give it back. Oh, goodness. You are very nice. Thank you. Oh, that got me an achievement. Cool. <laughs> Hello, sir. I need your shoes. <laughs> Let's be direct. Why won't you answer me, please? He's concentrating, I think. Ugh. Oh, I won't bother them now. Can wait until they stop playing. If they ever stop. Threaten them with a knife. Nah, no, better don't. Hello, Mr. Ant. How are you? I'm fine. Do you know by chance a certain Mr. Antonio, the greatest? Of course, he was a huge trumpeteer a few years ago. My mother loved his music. Oh, he was... Uh, he, so he was real. I saw him in the human world. He's very old now. Really? Wow, the human world. Well, you know. When we grow old, we all go to visit other realities to see if we've missed something. Oh, that's why he, he was there in my reality. We humans don't do that, I think. Oh, it's quite fun. I love to get letters from my mother. She tells me many things. This does sound fun. Well, I have to keep going. Great, so that was kind of pointless. Hello, Mr. Tree! Uh, yeah, that was pointless. <laughs> hmm. What to do now? Hmm, what to do now? Okay. <clears throat> okay, that's the same dialogue again. Can I throw the crayon there so he slips on it? Damn it, I clicked on him on accident again. No, no talking. No talking. Click, click, click. No. Well, I don't really know what the heck I'm supposed to be doing in here. <laughs> to do something to trick the dancer. I heard a creature here talking about layered realities, time and such. Rhythm and seasons are important in this land. Everything is connected. So I have to think that all time and space matters, and rhythm of course. Hmm. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm stupid. I could of course switch to something else. So now I can mistune the piano. That looks about right. Oh! Hello? 
dancer, mister? I really need to take your shoes. <laughs> and why is this? The shoes belong to the dancer. <laughs> I'm a dancer, and I need to do a dance with the wizard. Oh, I'm sorry, what did you just say? I want your fucking shoes! You want what? <laughs> <laughs> a little lemonade? You seem to be a little tense. No, sir, I don't want lemonade. Where did you get your shoes from? You should drink a little lemonade, at least to drown your first. Ugh. Sir, let me explain. I need your shoes. The wizard needs them. But that's impossible. I can't give you my shoes. The only way to get my shoes is to take them from me. And as you see now... I'm standing on them, so it's impossible. If you lift your feet, I could take them. Hmm. It can't be done. Only the very day when both my feet are up in the air. Only then can my shoes be taken. Otherwise, I will stand forever. This is so random and stupid. <laughs> I see. Well, thank you. I guess. I guess they fixed it. Yep, they fixed it. Oh! <laughs> uh, I liked that. That was good. I'm going to leave now. And never go there again. Uh. There you go, Captain Derp. I have the shoes. Whoa, you did it. You really have an extraordinary machine inside your head. Thank you, sir. Now let's do that the last one so I can go home finally. Without any special. Oh, there we go. The last one, air. Hmm, I recognize this feather. It belongs to Polontros. Yes, I saw him very injured. Hmm. He will be fine. He has the pink water. That can fix everything. Yeah, that's true. Well, what do we do with a feather? <laughs> Go visit the old Velocas mechanical doll. My wand will be there. I I have to finish my rabbit science. I think I have the answer. Oh, okay, sir. I'll bring you your wand. I still don't know how to... What to do there, though? Oh, I see. Now it has the wand in its hands. Ah, I have to, like, move it from hand to hand. Now oh, that hand nicks it. And that one. So that was the point of it all. Got it. Simple enough. That was actually really surprisingly simple. Alright, what messed up stuff is gonna happen now?